storm wound down. A truck plowed into the side of a building this morning in Stoughton. But police say the snowy road wasn't the biggest reason why. WBZ's Bill Shields is live in Stoughton tonight with the latest. Bill? Paul, it's a little bit hard to believe that allegedly someone was driving a truck while having alcohol in their system, but here's the result. See the tarp on the corner of this brick building? That's because they're boarding it up right now, trying to secure it for the night. Luckily, no one was hurt. It sounded like an explosion. It was a box truck that must have missed its turn, slamming into the front of this Stoughton office building. Sheila LaFrance was at her desk about 30 feet away. And I ran in there to make sure the gentleman was okay. And he um, told me that he was all right. He gave me a thumbs up. The driver wasn't hurt and has been identified as 50-year-old James Obala, who's now facing some serious charges. Took out three cars in the whole front of the truck is inside the building. We don't know why. That's under investigation, but we do know that we have charged him with operating under the influence of alcohol. Luckily, there was no one in the front office that got destroyed. And some workers in the back of the building were unaware of what happened. Our coworker came up to us in the lunchroom and uh, he was like, uh, my wife just texted me a picture of a box truck in a, in a building. And uh, it just happened to be our building. But this medical IT company was shut down for the day. Our bosses was like, get out, get out, get out, because the office was filling up with smoke quickly. And police would not say exactly why they charged the driver with OUI, but they have, and he will be arraigned tomorrow. Reporting live from Stoughton, I'm Bill Shields, WBZ News. Bill, thank you.